Hi everyone, welcome back. As you can see, we are in the empty pig pen. It's been pretty quiet now without them. Um, but this is just a disclaimer now. If you are squeamish, don't really like the sight of dead animals or anything, uh, please stop watching now. Um, but basically, just going to go through a little bit of uh, what we did for the whole sort of butcher process. Uh, we'll probably put up a little clip in the corner here, uh, just showing sort of the animal, uh, what we did sort of record um, while I talk here. Uh, so basically, uh, we're really grateful for our neighbor, uh, for one, for uh, letting us borrow his tractor uh, for this. Uh, without it, um, I don't think we would have been able to do it. Uh, so we had two pigs, uh, Patty and Selma. Selma was the bigger one, Patty smaller. So we did Selma first. Um, everything was going good. Uh, skinning was a little different. You know, we never have done pigs before. Um, but it went well up to that point. Uh, from cutting it down to get our pigs into freezer camp, so to speak, it got more frustrating from there. So we didn't really record any of that stuff because we were just focused on getting the pig cut up. Um, it is a lot harder than what some people on YouTube make it look. That's for sure. Uh, but yeah, so from this point on, we enjoyed doing the pigs, the butchering, not so much. Uh, we did call around to our local butchers and basically average to get a pig done, just cut and wrap it, which is what we want to do anyway, is about 120 to 150 a pound. Uh, so that being said in mind, we think it's more economical for us in the future to take our pigs to a butcher. It saves us the frustration of what we experience this time around. <clears throat> so, yeah, uh, basically, I guess if anyone is curious on how much meat we got off the pigs, uh, Selma, the first one we did, she was a bit bigger. Um, and we got about 100 pounds, 100 to 110 uh, off of her. Uh, we did made everything boneless uh, just because of how it was going, cutting the pigs up. But uh, so keep in mind, if you have like bone in pork chops or, you know, bone in things, the end weight is a little more because, of course, bone adds to that weight. Um, and then Patty, the second one we did, we got about 90, 95 pounds off of her. Uh, so, yeah, that's pretty much a wrap of our pigs. We enjoyed doing them. Um, it was really hard to see them go because we've just, you know, spent a whole, what, five months with them, seeing them every day, feeding them, giving them pets, you know, and everything like that. So... Yeah, um, <clears throat> anyway, that's pretty much it. Uh, I know this video wasn't really too exciting. It's a little sad, very quiet now, but uh, thank you guys uh, for sticking with us and we hope to see you in the next one. Have a good day.